Stop worrying about the bill that's not paid. Stop worrying about the children that you don't have. Stop worrying about your job. Stop worrying about the fact that you're not married. Stop worrying. God doesn't want you to worry. God's not going to show up while you are worrying. His word says, be still and know that he is God. The time that you're spending to think about the bills when you should be thinking about him. Change that. God is saying change that. Meditate on him and stop meditating on your problems. Nothing is going to change when you think about them all the time. God wants you to channel your focus on him. God's not going to show up while you are worried about the situation. In the book of 1 Kings chapter 19, when Elijah was worried about his life, the Bible says that a strong wind came and God didn't show up in the wind. An earthquake came and God still was not in the earthquake. And a fire came and God wasn't in the fire. You would have thought that God would have been in the fire because our God is a consuming fire. But it goes to show us that God is not going to show up when we expect him. And the Bible says he showed up and how he showed up was a still small voice. And there he was asking Elijah, what is he worried about? And Elijah was worried that they're going to kill him. He said, all the prophets are dead. He's the only one left. Be still means to take your mind off it completely because God is not going to show up while you are crying, while you are praying, while you are stressing about it. He's not going to show up at that time, but he's going to show up at his time or in his perfect time not when you expect it not when you're stressed not when you're crying he's not going to show up at that time because he wants to show you that he is god he wants to show you that he does things according to his timing he was the only one left and he did not lose his life because god was the one keeping him and god even sent him back into the city or different cities to go and anoint people. Why are you worried about your bills? You cannot get evicted. Why are you worried about your children? Children that you don't have. You are going to get children. It doesn't matter what age you are. It doesn't matter what you are worried about. God doesn't want you to worry about it. He says, be still and know that he is God. Be still means to be quiet. Be still means to stop crying. So not when you expect it. And it says, and know that he is God. It means that know that he's not man. Know that he's not your friend. Know that he's not your boss. Know that he's not your husband or your spouse. He's not anybody else who will likely disappoint you. He's not anybody else who is going to show up halfway for you or sometimes for you. When he shows up, he's going to show up big time. When he shows up, he's going to exceed your expectation. The little bill that you're worried about so much is going to be like nothing because the amount of money that God's going to bless you with is going to be like nothing. You're going to see why it was so important for you to stop worrying. You're going to see the reason why it was so important for you to be still. Elijah didn't lose his life. God showed up. God's going to show up for you. It doesn't matter what it looks like. He is going to show up for you. The ravens have to fly down to the ground to eat. Something has to die for them to eat. And they're not dying of hunger. There's always something dying for them to eat. Let alone you. You're human. You are God's perfect creation or his most magnificent creation. God would never let you go dying for hunger. God is going to show up. God is right there already going through with you, waiting for the perfect opportunity to show up for you. But you need to take your mind 
of this thing. You need to stop crying. You need to be still and know that he is God. I'm Pastor Marion. Please like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time.